So here we go. And welcome to Bloody Woman. This is a number game on itch.io, as always. Uh, however, it's not free. It's about a dollar and a bit. Wouldn't be able to tell you exactly how much, but it's quite short, which is unfortunate because I've played free games that are like an hour and a half, two hours long from itch.io as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm not too keen on, on the dollar and a bit payment, considering it's like 10 to 15 minutes long. 10 to 20 but hey I mean if it's good fair enough then but we'll we'll just have to see so uh let's get right into it 616 games presents presents the credits that's what they present <laughs> seriously I, I don't like seeing the credits at the front I know why you do it so the people see who was involved right you, you want to make sure that people know your name if you're proud especially if you're proud of the project but at the same time you don't put the credits at the front it's very dragging if that's the word i'm thinking of i don't know i think i'm just used to them being at the end i still read them well at the end so to me it's just a bit frustrating oh jesus all right First night at work and I'm already going to be late. Perfect. You wouldn't want it any other way. Uh, I say this a lot, right? Always be late on your first day. Shit, who the fuck invented a job? Yeah, I know, right? Because if you're late on the first day, right? Your expectations from the manager are super low. So if you do fuck up, yo, it's fine. He already expected you to mess up. It, it, it's, it works perfectly almost every time, basically. Up on 24 hours, okay. <laughs> Does it... Doesn't he look... Similar to someone? He looks very familiar. I don't know. Steph, good evening, and you must be the new employee. I arrived late. Yes, indeed, my good sir. Good evening. Sorry for the delay, I, uh, I missed the bus, I had to walk. You lying sack of shit, you just got off the bus. I'm late for an appointment. I don't have time to explain your work. Great. Perfect. We don't want it any other way. Okay, no problem. I just need to take care of the laundry and take care of the customers who need help, right? Exactly. I left a, I left a paper with some tasks for you. Be careful. The night shift is sinister. Uh, sinister? What, what do you mean by this? Did you know the story of the bloody woman? I do not, my good sir. Bloody woman? No. I don't know any of them about that. Ten years ago, a woman worked here on the early morning shift, but a machine shorted, shorted out, shorted, 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 shorted out, and the laundry room caught fire. Perfect. Was she not? Could she not just like walk away? <laughs> she was trapped inside. She had ninety percent of her body burnt, but was still rescued alive. Oh, trapped inside. Okay, so I, I guess she couldn't skedaddle. It was more a skedaddle bang on the door, and then just keel over. I think it was something like that. After a few months in the hospital, she had disappeared. Her parents was terrible. She was completely discom dis discombobulated. It's disconfigured, but I like the word. Uh, the laundromat was rebuilt two years ago. Since then, it torments and kills everyone. It works the late, sh late night shift. Why? I don't understand ghost stories. They make no sense. So she, 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 she got burnt alive, right? Then presumably died, right? And now she haunts this place and kills everyone that works here now. Is it just jealousy that they're better than her? That they managed to not short out equipment? Or even at, even at that point, it wasn't even like her fault. <laughs> Why do you care who works there? No one locked you in. You locked yourself in. <laughs> My God, this is real. What the fuck, man? I'll be on the. I'll be on the late late, 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 late night shift. Relax, man. It's just a legend. I gotta go now. See you later. Why don't Why don't you do it then? Why don't you You got an appointment? Well, screw you up. He. I'm telling you, dude. He looks very familiar to someone. I just don't know who. Water just. I'm not thirsty right now. Oh, no worries. The shift. This shit. This sh shit doesn't even work. 
<laughs> Newbie to-do list. Clean the floor, fold the wash clothes, and put them on the shelf. Take out the trash. Well, how about I just don't? Are these the clothes I need to fold? Why am I folding the clothes and not the people that come here and put it in the wash? They should come back, grab their clothes, fold it themselves, and skedaddle. Why, why do I have to do it? It's just more work for me. How do I put it away now? Oh, wait, I still have some here. Okay, it's clean. Fair enough. Uh, no trash. I can't take that out just yet. Do I need a... F I'm not folding these. I'm folding these, I'm assuming. Right? I might... I'm doing... I, I want to go look around. Oh, here's the trash. Why? I have a very good question, actually. Why is the laundry mat... In the middle of God knows where. It's surrounded by trees. Wouldn't you want a laundromat in a town? Right? It just kind of makes sense. Your customer base is so much higher. What, what are you... What a bop. God damn. Ra you know what, Radio? You stay on. It's a bit too quiet. Quiet. Hey man, what's uh, I don't like that letter on you, mate. Do not like that letter on you. Good night. <laughs> Sorry, that just kind of racked my brain. It's night shift, so he's saying good night as in good morning. Sorry, wow. Uh, I've never seen you around here. Yeah, I'm new. What does it matter? Good evening, sir. It's my first day here. How can I help you? I just came to pick up my clothes that I left here in the morning. Aren't you afraid to work here at night? I just got here. Why is everyone trying to scare me? Why would I be afraid? I'm just working. Don't you know about the legend of the bloody woman? I would never agree to work here at night. <sighs> Listen, I just got here. I was late. And now I need to deal with your bullshit. I skedaddle, if, if, if you may. Yes, I already know about the legend. I'm not afraid. It's just a legend to scare children. It's not a legend. I've always been a customer of this laundromat. I knew the woman and had... I knew the woman had an accident. Her name was Mary. Bloody woman, bloody Mary, because her name's... Like, really? Fair enough. She was very good. She was a very good person. You think she's dead, do you? Other a fire and burns, she became someone else. I visited her in the hospital twice. You're just a customer and you're visiting someone. Listen, I go to my corner shop every day, right? I'm basically best friends with the seller. Doesn't mean I will visit him in the hospital. It's just a bit off, right? I mean, yeah. then she disappeared. Now they say she kills everyone who works here on the late shift. I just heard the story earlier. I'm sorry, but I'm not afraid. I'll I'll get your clothes. You're very you are very beautiful. If you need anything, just call me. I see why he visited. Thanks. I'll get your clothes. Fucking creep. You're telling me I'm very beautiful. Listen, thanks. I I appreciate it, but like really? Really? At 12 a.m. At 12 a.m. You're telling me this when we're alone. I I don't feel comfortable. Is it these? Oh, okay. Wilson. Bye. That door is really aggressive. God damn. Can we go do something else? Oh, fold clothes. Very nice. Where do I put? On the bottom. Yo, could you imagine if the game had you like actually fold the clothes? God, that would be painful. Okay, clothes folded successfully. Glad you know how to fold clothes. Yeah, at 12, you are very beautiful. I... I don't know if I prefer the guy or that... Fucking... Pile of flesh. What am I... What am I doing? 
Let me read the list again. Fold the clothes, clean the floor, I did those. I just need to take out the trash. But I can't. What do I... I guess I'll just stand here and look pretty. I got nothing else to do. Hello? I did a whole ass circle. Oh, I just had to wait for the people to come in. All right. Hi. Hello, my name is Martha. I've come to pick up my clothes. It's already paid for. Great. Good evening, ma'am. Have you been a customer of this laundry for a long time? Yes, I've been washing clothes here for a few years. You know anything about the fire that happened here? Why are you asking now? Really? The one person that said nothing. You couldn't go without it. There was a, that was a long time ago, but I heard about it. It was all over the newspapers. You know anything about the woman who worked there? I didn't know her, but I heard she, she, she had burns all over her body. You don't believe in the legend of the bloody woman, right? No, I know it's just a legend. Thank you. Uh, can you. Can you take my clothes? Okay, sorry to bother you. I'll go get your clothes. All right, here you go. Bye. Cool. She really likes the color red. Like, really, really. Can I take out the trash now? Yes, I can. Good. Why are you holding the bag so close to your face? Oh. Is that blood? What the fuck is going on here? Yeah. Good question. Cool. Not scary at all. I've seen spiders more scary than you, ghost. What the fuck? Fucking raccoons. Honestly, these, like, raccoons are like the worst ever. They dig through all the trash. God. I... Really? <laughs> See, that would have been scary if they didn't spoil it by having a screenshot of that on the itch.io page. The first one got me because I didn't expect it. But the second, the second one didn't get me. I can't turn, I can turn off the radio. Shit, is anyone there? Would you mind not doing that, machine? Thank you. Thanks. Much appreciated. Well, that's it. I got all my trash to take out. Place is clean. Oh, new client. Why the f fuck does it look like Heisenberg-ish? Not really. I thought it, I thought it was a guy with like a, a Russian gas mask with side on. Right? Doesn't it look like that? Kind of. Not really. No. Not even close. Good evening, young man. You are a wide, wide boy with some really stubby, like, dinosaur arms. <laughs> Did you start working here today? D sorry, I just started dozing off. Uh, good evening, sir. Yes, it is my first day here. How can I help you? Uh, I came to get my clothes. Oh, my God, they were so day. Really, my... Excuse me, sir, can I ask you something? Fuck, you're asking everyone. Of course, boy. I love talking to the laundry mat. L laundry mates? Laundry mats? L I love talking in the laundry mats. <laughs> you seem to be a long-time customer of this laundry. I think the legend of the bloody woman is real, or am I going crazy? You're losing it, my friend. You are absolutely losing it. Bloody woman, yes. I always knew it was real. I've seen her wandering around here at night. Oh, great, fantastic. W what do I do? She wants to kill me. I didn't do anything to her. Did he just... Oh, that's Steve saying that now. 
There's no escape, boy. She was just working. That's what. Okay, so what happened? Why it's confused me. It was me saying that, then Steve repeated it, which I'm assuming Steve was supposed to say this. But now it's saying that I said this. So just, I'll, I'll, I'll run you through it, don't worry. Steve says, there's no escape, boy. She was just working here. What happened was horrible. Please, just get my clothes. I need to go. Right. Yeah, they uh they need a they need a patch that one up real quick. Can I can I there you go, good sir. Bye. He is a wide boy. I'm sorry for making fun of him. I'm sorry. Why? Huh? Oh, it's raining now. I love the rain. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Ugh. Oh, that's the trash. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm all good. What do you want from me? Leave me alone. Watch it, it would just be a prank. <gasps> Do you think it could be like a conspiracy th conspiracy thing that she was locked in and burnt alive? And then because she survived, someone snuck in the hospital, stole the body, and threw it in there, and that's why there's blood there. That's why she haunts here. Because she doesn't know who locked her in, so she just kills everyone on the night shift. Big brain! Can I not just, like, leave? Leaving would be hella cool. Why are you... So this guy thinks someone's out to kill him, but he's still here working. It never came to mind, ah, oh, you know what, maybe I should leave. But if you manage to die, when there's this... Fat window. Hello? I think it's more on you than anyone else. Right? Like... I don't know. Oh, fucking... Oh... Uh, I'm good. I hate being in the dark. Even more when it's raining. Really? I'm the exact opposite. Good evening, sir. Please need, please need to help me. You need to help me. Relax, boy. I am very, you are. Right, let's try that again. <clears throat> Relax, boy. Why does everyone keep calling me a boy? You are very scared. What happened? The bloody woman, she's back. She's going to try to kill me. Shit, what do I do? The bloody woman. <laughs> it's just a legend, boy. Rest assured. I'm not a boy. I'm a big grown man. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I saw her. I swear. I'm sorry. I'm really late for an appointment. What fucking appointments do you guys have at like one in the morning? What are you doing? What are you doing? An appointment. Screw it. It's not one in the morning. It's 12. What appointment do you have at 12? Just help me. Could you could you take my clothes? Okay. Thanks for your help, sir. Should have just called him a cunt. Would have been so much easier. And now you're dead because now there's nothing else for you to do. The problem with uh, with with a lot of these jump scares is the game wants you to constantly moving around to constantly be moving around so that the trigger. You can trigger the jump, the, the, the spook. You're not scared. Come back here. Oh, what happened? What am I looking at? Holy shit, who's dead? My god, it's the guy who works here in the afternoon. Shit, shit. Oh, it's that fella. 
Time to leave. Bye. Peace. Didn't want to go there. I'm next. Because this guy refuses to leave. So, here we go. Daily news. Today, with great sadness, we report a fire in the laundry in the city set city center, surrounded by big ass pine trees. Cool. <clears throat> After a short circuit in the wires, the laundry room caught fire, and the fire took over quickly. The tenant who worked at the site at dawn had 90% of her body burnt, and is in a coma at St. Thomas's Hospital. Mary, only 25 years old, is completely deformed and is fighting for her life. May God have mercy on his soul. What? His soul? Uh, Mary's, Mary's a, a woman. I'll have you know. <laughs> I just want to go home. I just want to go home. The f Fuck, oh, god damn it. More, really? Alright. Hello. Good night, boy. It's a beautiful night. Don't say good night. No one says that. Good night means you're going to sleep. Or good night, and someone accidentally pulls the trigger, shoots you in the head. Sir, please, I need help. There's a dead guy back there. Someone is trying to kill me. I know. Poor Stefan. Just a working man. Just like you. Mary won't stop. She wants blood. Are you kidding me? You know the bloody woman. Yes. I know her. She's not part of this world. She's... She... She's not part of the world of the dead. But your death is guaranteed, boy. She won't let you go. What the fuck? Where did you come from? Why is this hitman looking motherfucker telling me I'm gonna die? Shit, who the hell are you? I'm nobody. I'm just working, just like you. What is going on? All right, outside. Time! Come here. Come here, little shit. Oh, what the fuck was that? She inside? Oh god damn it. Alright. Follow these. Okay. Dead. <laughs> Wait, you roll the credits twice? Right, I um I really like the game. Uh, it's definitely worth the dollar and a bit. I, I, uh, I was complaining about before. Um, like, it's not like it's a lot of money. It's just that for such a short game, it doesn't make sense to charge people. But, admittedly, it is, it is really, really good. So, I, I see why they charge people, and I, I think I would too. It's good. It's well made. I really didn't like the credits at the start. Because you put them at the start and at the end. It's like, why? The end one, I understand. But the one at the start is like, it's very jarring. Like, it's just... Leave it for the end. Especially if you're doing some at the end as well. Don't put it at the front. You could have done something else instead of credits, I, I, I think. You could have done some sort of scene with the fire, right? Instead of the credit scene. Otherwise, I'm happy with the game. It was a good game. A lot of the spooks were good. The last one got me a little bit. Because I expected to turn around and for her to be standing there. But no, sh I, she just started sprinting as soon as I got to the end of the hallway. But uh, yeah, that's about it. If, if you enjoyed the video, fantastic. Might as well leave a like, might as well sub. You'd be pretty damn cool. If you didn't, well, that's, that's, <laughs> that's unfortunate. But hey, might as well check out my other videos. Uh, sub anyways. Like I said, Beam and G was coming soon. But yeah, man, that's about it. I'll, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Adios.